All right, we've returned. It's Monday. The Wacky Weekly is fixed as far as I'm aware. As far as I'm aware. And uh, that changes the whole idea of what I think about the Weekly, pretty much. I don't really like any of these, to be honest. Yeah. Okay, anyway, sorry, I was like, my brain. Um... Hmm. We did Puzzle and Dragons. We had a lot of success doing June Quest, and now we're here. And, um, we kind of just instantly lose, right? Yeah, I mean, two threes just win. That's kind of how that goes. Uh, so... It does, like I mentioned, change sort of my entire evaluation of how this weekly works. Um... More in the later... Because, like, now there's not really much of a reason to take see an enemy and dragon. So, like, you kind of want things that just have abilities in battle. Uh... Spawners can be good. I feel like you'll run into matchups where someone will buy one unit and stack it with a lot of stats with like cows and zebras and pears and stuff. And then that might end up like wrecking your whole team if it just has a garlic. But then otherwise it's mostly gonna be Yeah, it's mostly gonna be spawn snipe related, I feel like. Hmm. I I guess you're supposed to take the level just to get something interesting. Yeah, that counts. That counts as interesting. Unfortunately, it, it kind of means there's not a whole lot for me to look for here. I don't even want any of this. I can't imagine I win this round, which is not good. It's not a good thing. Yeah, it's not, not good. Definitely not good. It's actually the worst possible thing. I don't remember if I mentioned this on yesterday's session, but I do have a haircut. Got a haircut this past weekend when I went to visit my parents. Um, we are still rocking the Jeff Follin music, R.I.P. Well, this is just strange. Yeah, that was not the correct way to do that. Should have just done this and then and then done that. Mistakes were certainly made. I mean, that'll do more damage in front now, because it's gonna get double pogoed. <laughs> what do you want me to do with this? What do you want me to do with this? I mean, I can get a level next turn, which is strong. It's just pretty damn awkward. What does this do when it's level two? Two spaces, one damage. Okay. Well, we're already kind of uh, losing by a lot anyway, so why not uh, do some more of that? Well, you know what? That that worked out not so bad. Except for the part where it worked out bad. <laughs> okay, if you want to watch runs where I succeeded, I would recommend you go watch... Uh, last Wednesday's video because I uh that video was great I believe the one is called believe in the birds does this actually work it does that's so sick okay I mean that's pretty good I, I do need to buy units though I mean that that works for this, just to give it stats more. Seems okay. But like this, maybe? Because we're not level two in the Basilisk. I guess just the two, three, because it's the strongest. This seems not so bad, maybe, hopefully. Okay. Yeah, that seems pretty good, in fact. 
kind of comes with getting a level on a turn like that. Damn, this song's already going off. Spider-Man and X-Men. Spider-Man and the X-Men. Revenge title. Woof. Damn, Jeff, the Fallen's cooking on that one. Almost too much. I gotta turn it down a little bit. Um. Anyway. Yeah, this seems pretty good. This is also good. I will do this. I would almost rather... Yeah, yeah, give me something like this. Now, now give all of that attack stats. That seems good. This will trigger the, the camel. That seems also not bad. Now that's... That's interesting. I could go between and just stat up again. I don't think the Nightcrawler... I mean, you could Nightcrawler in the back. It's not the worst idea, I guess. For every three gold spent. I guess if I buy, sell, buy, that's technically one more gold. I don't know if that makes a difference, but it might. But also just getting a bunch of attack on both of these is, also seems pretty good. We do have the spawner thing. Let's try this. Let's try this. And then I'll freeze this. This is pretty good. These are, those are good units. Although I am I did just realize my guy in the back is <laughs> okay. Not the best choice it turns out. Well, it drew. <laughs> All right. Seems good. You could have done uh, the whole, okay, camel. We'll definitely camel. Don't sell that yet. Just do this. Then, meh, and then, uh, again, you can kind of just do that. I'll do this for next turn, I think. And then the question is... I mean, do I want to give this the stats? Probably not. Probably want to do like this. But then that means this is awkward. So then you could put one in the front. But then it, I guess you're still being awkward either way. You don't really want to do this because you want the elephant to happen. I'm all over the place, huh? Okay, so what I could do is... Duckling, Cell, Weasel, or I can just go like this. And then you know what? Put... I, I, I think I do it like, like it like this. Because now... That means that, uh... The elephant will be even bigger. There's a plan. I don't know if it's a good plan, but it is a plan. See, we get two attacks out of that. That's gonna get three triggers, four triggers. Not a bad plan. Turns out. Too bad I'm only on two wins after seven turns. Oy, oy, oy. Okay. This is probably just good. Good unit. Probably garlic you. Two, three, four. Okay, we got a lollipop. Uh, yeah, I don't think that does a whole lot for me. I mean, we could make a whale a ten four, which is funny, but I don't think it's good. I actually kind of just think this on this is probably the best thing. And then you hear something like this. Yeah, and I just don't want that. Just actively don't really want that. Okay, let's try this. We're like super snipe strats. No bonus beyond our buying of pets as far as that toy goes. 
A banana. Okay, you have spawn. Ooh, a level 2 Nightcrawler. Yeah, that might spell problems, but... I'm gonna get a lot of snipe equity. Okay, I don't know why the poison dart frog didn't do anything. Do you not work? Alright, I don't even get to see it. I think flea makes a lot of sense. I think it's a safe bet. As far as, um... If someone is going one big pet strat. Seems like a good... Good case to go with. Okay, I didn't expect that to happen. Oh, that's pretty bad. Um... I, I guess I just am supposed to do this. It's a little... Eh? A little meh. Okay, so... Probably this, and then I guess I'm beefing you up a little bit. What does this do again? Remove frontmost perk? Nah. Sure. A lot of pre-game snipes, I suppose. Hmm, those are some good abilities you have there. Those are some good abilities, but we do kind of have the benefit of the whole weakness thing, plus a couple of dudes. So this is just way more RNG than normal. I mean, I know there's the money, but it is still just kind of insanity. Um, this feels like a good choice. Like, a 12-12 seems like something that is not easy to obtain. So I like that idea. Doesn't really feel like something I want to give a pair to, but a pair is just also really good. Okay. I mean, that kind of, it'll buff the orangutan. Then you do this for that to also get a buff out of it. Seems okay. Do this to buff just anyone, I guess. Really? Um. Sure, do this guy. Another one of you seems okay. This also seems like a good choice. Probably sell you, because we do need a slot. Although I am realizing there's just not really enough space for everything, huh? I guess this is- it's better to lose out on one level th one, one three three than a 4-4 four, four monkey? I guess? Right? Something like that. <laughs> Although Death Touch is also really good, but maybe we'll try- we'll use that next turn. I mean, these are good units. What other tier 5s are here? There's some pretty good tier 5s. I'll leave the rest open, and I'll go... Like this. Alright, let's see what happens. We have a lot of spawn strat stuff and one biggish guy in front. Unfortunately, that does not look like it's gonna be enough. Because unfortunately. Wow, that was just. That was just not what we wanted to see. You guys only had two triggers, huh? That was that was kind of a huge bummer. <laughs> uh, these are not what I want to be giving chocolate to, but I can't buy a cow unless I just give me something that I actually want to buy, please. And not really, but. <laughs> Okay. Level 2 Silver Fox. Garlic would be sweet. I'll take another Death Touch. Actually, level you. Uh, okay, yeah. This. This. And before we get double sniped by a woodpecker. <laughs> Here it comes. Here it comes. It did not. I think that that was pretty nice, it turns out. Um, I know I mentioned this last time, I believe. I needed to tell a story about driving because I was driving. Do I want any of those units? Not necessarily. I was, ooh, this is, that's a great purchase. I was driving 
and as you do. And um, I go past a, it was a four way light situation. Go across as you do. After that, there's a straightaway for a little bit into a left turn bend, right? Not right, correct? I'm driving. Another car coming my, you know, coming from the other direction. Almost didn't even parse it at first, but quickly realized the car coming from the other direction is driving in my lane at me. You know, like on in the wrong lane, driving the wrong way. That's terrifying. <laughs> I've never experienced that before. Uh, it was indeed terrifying. And um, I guess what I would say is uh, I was, it all happened so fast. I was about, like, as soon as it, like, recognized, I was, like, about to lay on the horn. But, like, as I was, uh, I was doing the hand motion to lay on the horn, whoever was driving realized what the hell they were doing. And they did, like, a... They, they did, not that, not at that extreme, but they, they did a swerve back into the correct lane. And then things just, like, continued as normal. But it was, like... It all happened in like three set, you know, three to five seconds, but it was just slow mo. I was like, that just that just happened. Like that was insanity. I've never. The only thing that I could assume for that to be something that happens is is just that they were on their phone, right? Like, what else would it be that ca would cause that? I can't think of anything. I'm kind of interested in a pug because a level two macaw would be pretty dope. And, uh, as I says it, it happens. And then now you just do this instead, because that's just worth it. That's just mega worth it. Um. We do have to be four squatted, which is kind of stinky. So maybe I should have bought the what's-it-calls-it to get um, okay, those are those are all pretty good. Well, not those, but okay. Uh, it would have been cool to have that without that, but here we go. I think the pug still goes first, right? Oh, it does not. It does not. But I think we're. St oh no, because you have all those. Never mind. Damn. Level, that was a level 2 wolf, maybe? Okay. Peanut. No. Okay, I can get behind that. Get behind that a little bit. I'm not gonna put him in front because of the peanut. I do realize that. I do realize that. 12 12 orangutan does still seem pretty good. And pug the snake, which seems not the worst thing ever. Would I rather have a 12 12? I, I don't know what happened. Wait a second. We have to see what happens here for science. Do you give the peanut and then it spawns an orangutan with a peanut? Because that would be insane. <laughs> that would be so sick. I have to know. I have to know just for science sake. Please work. This would be so sick. No! Wait, it still spawned it with a peanut though. Okay. How'd you get a level 3 fly? What are these people doing to get a level 3 fly? Oh no, because you had that, so you had like 2.11 and then a fucking... God damn. 5 wins. This is going to be hard to get 10 wins. I still don't get why so many people look at their phone while driving. It's crazy to me. I mean, this is just terrible. <laughs> this is just 
It's just all around terrible. First round feels even worse than normal because you can't even be like, oh, well, I'll take a bad round here and then it's fine because I'm going to have a good round, round two. But no, you just lose everything. The only time I've ever looked at my phone driving is simply to, uh, like, for direction-wise. But that's not, like, looking at your phone that's, like, you might hold it up in front of you for... You you might see it to see, like, the exit number or something if, it, if you didn't hear what the voice said. But you wouldn't actually just, like... Anyway. It's craziness, is what it is. I guess this would get a level which would level the like give the mermel a benefit. So there's something to consider about merging these two, or just doing that, and then doing a roll because you don't want to remove any of those abilities, and then you take a two three. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I don't know. Hmm, level 2 Basilisk. See, a 1-9 does not really do a whole lot. That's what I've learned. That's what I've learned. It's all gone. There was certainly something to be said about doing a level to... You know, get... In order to get something spawned as a thing for next turn. That's like the idea here. Uh, I guess I can take this and then save a gold for next turn. Seems like a much worse team than last turn. But we'll see. Uh oh, that could be a problem. That is a problem, it turns out. Turns out that was a problem. Basically, basically just trying to take- okay, you gotta level this to see what happens. Whoa, that sound- that music went crazy there for a moment. They're both gonna jump in front anyway. I can't really do much about that. Triple kangaroo is nutty. That is, we just, there's no way we can beat that team anyway. Even if they didn't have the guy jump in front, we could have not have beaten that team, which is unfortunate because now we're at three health again, which is just, you know, not really what you want. Not really what you want. Be really sweet to get a second Ogopogo, but uh, I could have used the gingerbread plus Ogopogo there. Could have done that. We also don't have anything spawning anything, so that's pretty bad. Yeah, this also seems like a bad team. Maybe I've been a little too greedy now. Whale in the front, that is, that's a choice. I mean, we definitely lose though, anyway, it's not even close. Multiple level twos. That way you just pray, basically, is that what we do every round? Cake. I guess I would take a cupcake. And right now we're not even spawning anything. 
sick. We're just gonna lose every round now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we're just completely gambled on losing this round. I could sell this and buy this this turn, it doesn't really matter. I also think a cupcake is kind of worthless purchase for this round, but maybe maybe this guy can take it the whole way. I don't see how it's possible, but I'm I'm feeling like that's a no. Hmm, maybe it's enough. It is enough. Okay. We spawned one thing and it was enough. Turns out the gamble was worth. Okay. Good unit. Solid unit. Potential level. I don't think I... I could have could have arguably used the crow on it, I guess. Um... Little awkward. Don't think I want a honey. I think I'd. I think I need to roll to try and get things for like future rounds. None of those are that inspiring to me. I mean, this is pretty good. Okay. Okay. Not a lot of stats to be. Oh, I'm passing a chili. I meant to. No. Oh. I meant to do that, not how I did it, but... Oh, man, and... If that thing had... Oh, we chipped it away, that was so lucky. We got... We got away with that. <laughs> we got away with murder there. <laughs> not even gonna try to act like it wasn't. That was... That was murderous. Okay. I think that makes sense. Flea right here. <sighs> Would have been pretty sweet. Um, yeah, do that because it's getting the chili, I guess. Oh, we're fucking eating it. Oh my god, I can't do anything right. <laughs> I'm so tilted. I'm so tilted today. Oh, and then every and then that guy got shot too. And then we don't even have the. <laughs> we win. Okay. Even if I didn't mess up that, we weren't going to win because that nightcrawler at the back was gonna be huge. But that was, that was bad, man. That was bad. I should have done this first. I'm just tilted buying the thing that I had frozen. It's bad. We're in a bad place right now. We are in a bad place right now. Um, sure. Produce the most healthy enemy by thing one. Okay. Sure. And we're just gonna keep this cow, I think. Yeah, I think so. I think so. Okay, I'll freeze that. Spawn team stuff, potentially. Level two whale? Camel tech trust. Maybe like five rounds ago. How's this gonna work out? Okay, not great, turns out. Turns out, not great. One HP and that's a draw. These go by pretty, uh, no, we'll, we'll, okay, one more, I guess. I don't, I, I shouldn't, but I am doing so, I guess. Don't see this team winning. But, we're here. Um, booming. Booming. 
booming, booming. I'm trying to think what else happened this past week, because we didn't talk about a lot of it on uh, last night. Wow, we still, still no draw. Um, there was some video game stuff happening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There was the Silent Hill thing. Did not watch that. There was... Either I buy- I guess I'm going four squatted either way. Let's do this. Sell. And then just get this guy involved. Um. Didn't watch that. I did not watch the Sony State of the Play. There was... Oh yeah, the Zelda... Um. What do you call it? Lego set that was announced. I don't remember the price, but I all I remember is someone saying that you can buy like a Nintendo Switch and Tears of the Kingdom for the same price of the Lego set. Something insane like that. Um, something crazy like that. The uh, I guess I do this. Does that even work? I think you can do that, right? It does the da it should do the damage before, right? I'm looking for something to take multiple hits before the kangaroo. Did not find in it, but I can, I guess, double buff this to make it big and maybe live a couple hits. So I guess I'm doing that. But yeah, Lego has become like seemingly every other hobby or interest or thing that I enjoy somewhat ruined in one way or another by money we draw or rather people trying to make more money and be greedy basically how it has turned oh we get free rolls from that Because we had a level 2 guy. That's right. That's right. That is what happened. I couldn't remember. Guess I'll keep that. No. Two rolls. Three rolls. Four rolls. Oh, okay. That's, that's cute. You don't spawn anything. But it is one of the better choices, I suppose. Uh, can we get anything that spawns anything here, really, anyway? No. I guess that makes sense, then. Um, I don't kind of thinking about doing this and then just giving something more attack, like you, so you're like a 4-5-4. Four, four. Two, two s relatively strong guys in the middle, and then a little spawn -a at the end. You, on the other hand, have multiple spawneroos going on. Oh, uh, the 1 HP difference, man. Although, you just would have two of those anyway. Double Nightcrawler works. Works kind of well together. This works well. I'll even do that. I'll throw in that. Sure. Um. <laughs> okay. Psycho strat. Psycho strat incoming. Um. Something like that, something like that. Maybe gold? I'm trying to think if there was any... I guess I might as well roll first. Yeah, I would have rather you last turn to buy sell, but here we are. Okay. This will be interesting. Elephant tech. 
That would be a bad idea. It just hurts my guys and I don't have a camel. Hmm. Double night leveled up nightcrawler is no joke. But I, I did the thing, so. <laughs> I did the thing. Okay. Now this I will do. Ammo. Now if we get an elephant, then okay, then we're talking. Pogo Pogo good, this good. This is, you know, relatively good. This is okay. This behind camel or osprey makes a lot of sense. Damn. <laughs> um, you know what? God, that sucks. Because I can't gingerbread the camel because I already gave it a thing. Um, I could give it that in level 2, but then it's going to spawn two groundhogs and only one really matters. This just guarantees that hit, so I think I like that better, and then I'll just do this. Okay, let's see what happens. Weakness. Weakness. Okay. It's a big guy at the end. How did you do that? Turns out it doesn't matter. Okay. Looking better than any other time, I think. Find something to stat up. That is kind of what we want to see. Um, although, <laughs> we don't have a lot of money to buy and sell a lot more than that. So that is something to consider. Okay, roll. We really needed a sell ability there. <laughs> okay, roll. Okay, that's great news. this didn't want you to hit the beaver but fair enough um two shots with this or two can i guess kangaroo behind that can work and then this at the front i mean it's a decent turn i think i feel like that was a decent turn Alright, what do you got? Hmm, you skunked me. That's just really rude, if I'm gonna be honest with you. Thankfully, this- oh man, the garlic went really well. Okay. We drew. Hmm, <laughs> friend ahead faints, huh? I don't know if it's time for this one, necessarily, but... Did give enough stats to win, but I'm, I'm gonna roll. It is a unit that spawns things, which is good. Okay. Sure. Wait, backwards. <laughs> like, wait a second, that's not right. And then give this even more health with a health potion? Could arguably do this as well to give it, and then that way it has the chili pepper longer. Maybe? I could believe that. Okay, toy, I like that. And this is still okay. I'm not gonna freeze it though, because tier 5's next turn. But I will freeze the other one. Mmm, the poison dart frog does not work how they want it to work. Where shoots behind every attack type of thing which is what i also keep thinking it does but it does not gariel seems really good not a lot of things come out the gate with that much stats i don't think i'm looking for that i do like this i like that quite a bit could combine those potentially probably i mean You could do this and then pug something in the front as well. It's a little awkward. 
because you kind of want something that maybe does like a snipe after the fact, like a... Or spawn, I guess. Spawns work well with the weakness. Not quite. Not quite what I want. Gain health for each... Yeah, so this do this doesn't really work because of the non-bow there. I don't think this is really how I want to use my money, but... <laughs> well, the toy repeating is kind of insane, but I think I'll use it next turn. Because that doesn't really synergize with the Ogo. So then I'll do another spawner. Could have considered a Nightcrawler. But I think the Puma next turn or whatever it is makes sense with the toy. Mmm, monkey with banana, plus you killed an- Oh! I messed up their thing, they didn't eat the Nightcrawler. Oh, but what happened to the entirety of everything else that was happening? <laughs> they had some other gun ability, shot my- shot my Ogopogo, messed up a bunch of stuff apparently. Mmm... I mean, it's just a 4-4, four four, which is pretty good. Um, that seems quite good. And then I think I'll save these for next time. I think I'll save these, do a Gariel, do a Puma again, because that seems like a pretty good combination. And then... I guess take this, because if we got another one, we would wish we had it. Um, I know it's pretty greedy to keep those but this is a weird weekly and I'm, I'm trying to figure it out myself I mean, this is generally good get statted do this something like that not the most exciting but it is something and then it lets us look for next turn we love that we love a scorpion We got X-Men in here. Isn't that thing called a Nightcrawler? There isn't- oh, they have an insane team. But we sniped their turkey, so... <laughs> they, it doesn't matter, because they got to have a level 2 Macaw, which is just broken. So that's cool, I guess. I actually would rather this fur. Would rather this plus the Puma. Because that actually works. Doesn't really work with that. Wishful thinking, perhaps? <laughs> Wishful thinking, perhaps, with that? I mean... When in Rome... Um, do as the Romans do and such? I don't think that this... that Yeah, that won't do what we want it to. But we can have a snake and then a... Then a Little platypus action. Does something, I guess. Durian on, on this to make the snipes a little bit better. Seems okay to me. Money for next turn. Yeah, it is a Nightcrawler. I mean, if they don't have a Foam Sword... I feel like we... Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No! No! <laughs> S level okay, so level two macaws are broken. That's what we've learned. Level two macaques are broken. Very unfortunate. Very unfortunate. That's good. This is good. Turkey, fly, tiger. I think I'll actually gamble on this. Take this. Sell, buy, this. Uh, freeze. No, no, no. Stat. Uh, do this again. <laughs> I 
guess we're gambling for the level two or saving it for next turn. Kind of one or the other. Snake is probably better than the saber tooth. It's only gonna get one spawn. This will get multiple shots, which feels better. Plus, it will actually get buffed. Okay. Mm, this, and then we're you're four squatted because that's how it works. Except the peanut's gonna happen. Would I rather this get the peanut? Yeah, I guess I would. That is why we had the other thing in the front, though. The saber tooth in the front to do that made. Oh well. All right, whatever. Mistakes were maybe made. I guess it's kind of better to have the peanut. It's just that I bought the armor and it already would have gotten the peanut, so it didn't really make a lot of sense. But here we are. At the very least, it protects it from getting sniped. <sighs> it had a melon armor, man! You just happened to have the damn thing. Oh my god. So stupid. Alright. This weekly sucks. <laughs> I hate this. It's every turn is just misery. Just hoping you get a level. That's what it feels like. Anyway.